Well, happy Halloween, everybody. Yeah. yeah. It is Halloween. <gasps> uh, yeah, that means sitting on the couch, trying to, you know, have a nice afternoon. And being interrupted every fucking couple of minutes by the <laughs> by the doorbell yeah. ringing. Just don't answer the door. You can't. Then they fuck your house up. Do what do what I used to do when I lived in Huntington. You just turn off all the lights. Ah, uh, that's another thing. It's like <laughs> you turn off all the lights and and I we used to turn the TV in such a way that you can't even see the TV that is see, on through the windows. Uh, yeah, that doesn't work. I I, I, they, <laughs> I didn't want to deal with it. They come up to the door. You, you know, they know I'm in there. Just leave the bin outside with one of those fake yeah, ones. Man. You know sure. what? If it was just kids from my neighborhood, I would do that. But you know what they do. The uh, blacks? Yes. <laughs> there are certain uh, <laughs> more, more um, no white kids do say, this? underprivileged, of course, areas of Long Island and uh, uh, the, the, uh, pl- around the area that I live um, in Nassau County. And the, the parents, I guess, or parent, whatever, grandma, whatever, <laughs> Uh, tends to <laughs> tends to drive to these more they bust them in lucrative areas. Yeah, but we used to do the exact same thing. We would find the rich neighborhoods. Yeah, so yeah. when we were growing up, Hidden Lake. You remember, right? We'd go to Hidden Lake. Oh, I know. Yeah. I hear you. We would go to a couple towns over, knowing that the, you know yeah. it was a little better. And if someone did was stupid enough to leave all their candy out, and oh, you were one of the first to get there, you took it. Didn't matter what yeah. color you were. I was no. taking it, especially oh. if they had good shit. Yeah. Well, I like Smarties. Smarties. I like Smarties Yeesh. though. You picked a bad Smarties one. Smarties hurt. I like Smarties. They make your like the back of your no, mouth. No, you don't. Hurt. You don't like, bite ow. them. You just oh, kind of bite. Nah, them. You let them dissolve. Come on, everyone Take knows the whole that. Whole fucking. Yeah, taking the entire bin is not a race thing. That's, I don't that, think that, so at all. That's a teenager thing. You take the oh. stool that the yeah. bin is on. Right. <laughs> you just take I can all, I can only go by what I've seen. And I knew whenever I would see one of those take one bins as I'm walking up, I'm like, well, there's no candy in here. And there was never candy. Well, of there. course, it was already gone. Of course, never first. The so scene. then, of course, you got to egg the shit out of their house. <laughs> of course, we're not uh, taking care of you properly. Well, I, I don't like. Uh, I don't like feeling Blacks. like I have to take a bunch of candy and, and pick it out and throw it in their bag. So I just kind of hold out a thing, mm-hmm. big bowl thing, and let them pick. And of course, um, I've, I've conveyed this story in the past of how this uh, young African American child um, literally took his arm. Like, like, put his forearm in the candy and just swiped into his bag. Nice. I think I was robbed. <laughs> yeah, and, and he swiped like half the candy with his forearm into his bag. Wow. Uh, and then I, I got to stand there and go, hey, 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 hey. I don't think that's a uh, black thing. It was like Barney's. Yeah. Had to call the cops. <laughs> now old man Kumi is upset about Halloween and what blacks hey, have done to Halloween. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah, I'm a fist shaking <laughs> motherfucker when oh. on Halloween. It's so funny you mentioned Halloween. I, oh. I so my kid's not going to school today, and this uh-huh. is the reason. I just got a reminder email. Ooh. And I'm going to read it word for word. Uh oh, from the school. Dear parents, oh. happy Halloween. Ah, oh, that's nice. Yay. This is a friendly reminder that blank school is a costume-free zone. This is what I'm dealing with. So please, save those great costumes Uh. for trick-or-treating later this evening. All the best. What an unfun fucking country to try to get into. All the best. So that's Uh. why my kid is not going to school today. I'm not doing it that to him. He knows today's Halloween, and he knows... You know, he's going to be trick-or-treating, and he wow. and he can't wait to put his fucking costume on. Costume-free wow. zone. A costume-free zone. A fun-free zone. And I've talked to the parents, and no one is into this. No. They're like, why the fuck are they doing this? And don't don't throw that religious holiday shit at us, because no one acknowledges that Halloween's actually a religious holiday. And no one thinks that. No one thinks that anymore. It's just supposed to be fun. <clears throat> God, More costume suck. controversy on the news. Oh, that's what, uh, Pottery Barn, probably. Those cowards. What, what, what's this big problem? It looks it's like a, they were dressed up as no, the Jamaican bobsled team. The Jamaican team. bobsled team, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh the Pottery Barn had one. Where it was, they had a sushi chef outfit. Just the outfit that's a sushi chef. Yeah. Right. And one that was like a kimono. And they were called racist by an Asian American group. So they yeah. discontinued them. Of course they did. And there's another um, story I was reading about insensitivity. Uh... 
mm-hmm. because I guess uh, at a hospital they were having a little party and and somebody dressed as Obama with an Obama mask. It was like it wasn't blackface or anything. It was an Obama mask and put him in a straight jacket. And they deemed that insensitive and 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 told the, every staff member in the hospital that they then had to uh, uh, attend diversity training. <laughs> oh my no, God. I'm not kidding. Sure. What diversity does that do with diversity? training. I don't know. This and is what we're talking about. The, 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 the mental hospital guys that were with the Obama in the straitjacket yeah. were two black guys. So it was like, well, what's this well, yeah, but Yeah, but that's racist, though. It's so racist. Uh, it's cool if Bush has a Nazi hat on. Right. But you, don't. Could, you could dress like a Hitler Bush. It's unbelievable. That was fine. Eventually, all our kids are just going to be walking up to houses in their regular clothes. Yes. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you dressed up as someone about to get a kiss. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Hi. Happy Halloween here at Dave Herman's house. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to get a prize. I think his lawyer is uh, speaking out. We got to find oh, out. Oh, that lawyer. Right. Yeah. Oh, can you get that? Sure. But, the excuse uh, is retarded. I got, a, I got a second part to this. So I was, oh. I was talking to someone in my building about what I just read to you. Yeah. That's the reminder, but we've known for a while. You can't have your kid uh, go to school with costumes today. And then the guy just started telling me some of the dirt and some of the fucking assholes that live in my building. There's a lady that complained to this guy. and It's not even his job. Is she sure all that glitters is gold? There's a lady. Oh, very good. Shit, I should have <laughs> got that one. Um, but I guess somebody put Halloween um, decorations on their door. Uh oh! And she lives on the same floor. Yeah. And she goes, you know, that's illegal. You're not supposed to have anything on 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 your door. Uh, and then she goes, Are they going to do that for every holiday? That's not right. I need to talk to someone about this. How old is she? She, I don't know. He didn't. He didn't oh. give me an age, but I know this much. She doesn't have kids, obviously. Oh. So she's bothered by this family that has obviously uh, kids inside, and they put a couple dumb Halloween, you know, uh, decorations the on the door. The and I'm sure it's just people? basic shit, maybe a pumpkin or something. I don't think they went over the top. And she's losing her mind over that. She's a oh. cunt. That's the yes. Yes. She's yes. a cunt. That, yeah. yeah. And no one says Swiffer up her no ass. Too up. bad that you're upset. Yeah. 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 Live yeah. with it. But I yeah. told this guy, I go watch a memo's coming soon that uh, you know they're going to remind people that. You can't have decorations on your door because, like we always say, the minority fucking rules. Yeah. Well, we respect Period. everyone's individuality. Yeah, and yeah. so it'll be uh, blah, blah, yeah. blah. And then he told me about we another. Really don't. Yeah. He told me about another lady. He goes, she had a leak in her apartment. So we're trying to figure out where the leak was. Yeah. So Kelly. And his bears. Nice. She had a leak, so she went and did it. <laughs> So the guy's like, is the leak in um, the master bedroom or, I don't know, whatever, the the other bedroom? Yeah. She goes, uh, I would really appreciate it if you don't say master bedroom anymore to me. What? Because that brings us back to slavery ah, and come the on. time when there were <laughs> masters. Like a black woman or she's just a white lady? No, he, I, I did not ask that. I assumed it wasn't a black lady, by the way. Massa. A massa bedroom. That's what I call so, mine. So she has I a problem there. with the term master bedroom. That's crazy. People are losing their fucking minds. You live in a crazy building. I don't know if it's I guess, crazy. I think it's uh, we could we could take calls. I right guess now. master's degree. She probably yeah. have a problem with that. They yeah. should change that. I'm right. not the master of anything. Yeah. Well, I think they actually did change the. Um, you know how you can slave together. Yep. Uh, things like hard drives and whatnot. They changed that because they didn't like the word slave being used. It's fucking astounding. Language police. It's it's it make it like when I hear this, I feel it from the bottom of my throat oh. to my stump. Like it's it's, it's a Where physical the reaction. <laughs> no, I didn't say on my face and in my hair. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me so angry. It's like sometimes I don't want to be. I just can't be funny. I just want to just I, yell yes. dirty things. I just can't believe it. I can't believe this shit is real stuff. And it's become it, it's the norm now. Like yeah. we got we got a letter from my daughter's school. Saying that she could dress up for Halloween. Ooh, I know, and and nice. I shouldn't be actually surprised when I get that letter, right? You know, but I was, yeah, because I was like, expecting wow. her not to be, right? But I, no one speaks. How do, you, how do you tell a three-year-old he can't go to school in a costume? That's yeah. ridiculous. Because you know how excited everyone in my daughter's class is right. to dress up for Halloween. It was always yeah. so much fun. Think back, you know, going to school when you were a kid, dressing up. Oh, it was great. And if the one kid doesn't dress up, oh, oh well. Wow. Yeah. Guess what? Uh, the parent has uh, has to talk about it yeah. with their kid. Let the kid feel left out. What are you going to do about the kid in the wheelchair? Nobody can use oh. their legs at school. <laughs> we have somebody who's in a wheelchair, so everyone has to hobble around or crawl on your stomachs. 
Enough yeah, already. There was a story in, in Park Slope last year where. Like, oh, God. Oh, they got to change that name. Oh. That, sounds more like, that sounds like more like a mean order. I, I always notice they can't park. <laughs> where a bunch of parents, a bunch of parents wanted the, the ice cream trucks to stop coming around because they didn't want to have to deal with their kids not being able to get ice cream. They didn't want to have, have to tell their kids, no, you can't have ice cream right now. Mm -hmm. So no one should have ice cream. Mm -hmm. it, it, because they can't take. Because nobody wants to tell no and yeah, nobody they, wants they to say no. They can't be responsible enough to say no, you can't have ice cream right now. Can can they just they parent teach, maybe? Yeah. Yeah. Just like, just like schools. How about schools teach? Hey, there you go. There's a novel fucking idea. Instead of wasting so much energy on on this political correctness bullshit, how about we, we put kids through school so when they pop out the other end, uh they could actually read cursive. It's I heard they're not teaching cursive anymore. Did you hear that? Someone no, told me that racist. they are not teaching cursive anymore. Well, it's, I've, I've it, heard that. It's the dumbest it's thing ever. What, cursive? Or, yeah. yeah. I, don't, I don't know if they need it. I'm just saying that they're not teaching It's it. a discipline thing. I've it's been, a mental discipline. I've been block printing my ass off ever since I was oh, a little yeah. kid. I write cursive, but not well. I, I sloppy. No one, no one does it well. It's faster, though. I write in calligraphy. That's what I do. It takes 20 minutes per letter. <laughs> <laughs> I like to put heart over my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I read an article about like how... People aren't going to be signing I know, their I wrote names. the article. Oh, you yeah, did? oh. It's good. Go ahead, sorry. <laughs> People aren't going to be signing their names eventually. Why you know, that? if you're not learning cursive, how are you going to sign your oh. name? Oh, big yeah. X. Plus, you won't need it with, you know, what do you need? Fucking fingerprint phones. Who are you? Boop! Oh, okay. Uh, that's you. Oh, yeah. yeah. Let's say hi to uh, Chris in Pennsylvania. Hello. Hey, how you doing, guys? Hey. Hey, my last name is Coon. C O O N. Oh, boy. And I, and I, yeah, exactly. And I work. Everybody's last name is on their mailboxes, except for mine. Somebody complained, and now they use my first name. <laughs> first name is nigger. <laughs> no, his first name is Ama. <laughs> and, and they can't call me, my nickname is Coom Dog, because they can't call me that and at work anymore. But it's your name. <sighs> Well, that Jesus, how bad it is. what you should do That's fucking is you should, funny, but dude, why don't you complain uh -huh. and say that you want the same treatment as the other employee? Like, yeah, right. Because people take this shit. Equality. Nobody speaks well, up. I uh, yeah, I speak up. But what are you going to do? It's a big company, you know? Yeah, but it's my last need, name. Need the uh. fucking job. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Yeah, no, I don't want to see you get fired, but I mean, there's a way to speak up. And, yeah, that's true. I don't want to see <laughs> yeah. you get fired. They make, they make child pornography props. <laughs> <laughs> hey, punch it out, guys. Have a good sure one. Sure you are. See ya. All right, Coon. <laughs> Let's say hi to Tommy in Jersey. Tommy. Tommy. How's it going, guys? Right. Boy. Well, I'm a little tired. <laughs> I work for a, a, a school, and we have these workshops. And they showed us this one game called Asoko, and an Asian group complained, so they had to change the name. Because Aso? Asoko. Asoko. It's too Asian. Hmm. I don't understand you're just, it. You're just anymore. showing the world you're, like, weaker when um, you speak up about some of this shit. I said some of it, because, you know, maybe case-by-case -case basis, but you just show, like, you're a weak person. Yeah. I think it's bad for any group to be represented by somebody that... Presents himself as so oversensitive and weak and oh, fucking, they awful. can't handle it. Right, handle it's it. attention oh, seeking. It's it's it's, it's people oh, yeah. feeling a little it powerful is. in the moment. Right, right. It's Look at all me. self interest and self serving yeah. and insincere shit. Uh, Doug in New York, what's up? You, you're happy that kids can't wear costumes at school? Absolutely. Hmm? Okay. Why? Uh, because I remember as a kid, I would wear a costume, and if my costume wasn't as nice, you know, kids are a bunch of jerks. So. Good. No costume. I don't want these kids to have any fun at all. I love banning this stuff. Mm. I go to the meetings uh, with the other parents, and there's always a parent hey, hey. you open. It's like, <laughs> let the kids have this thing. Let them have fun. I'm like, no. No fun. Nothing. No cell phones. No costumes. No. Well, planes. are you kidding or are you serious? Of course he's kidding. No, I'm absolutely serious. So are you just coming from a baby boy? I'm jealous that they have what I don't point of view. I bet. I'm not happy, yeah. Because I'm like, school is work. I don't want them to do anything. I want them to sit there. To I don't believe you. Yeah, uh, you're bullshit. Yeah. You're bullshit. Yeah, you got to do a better job. With Only your because somebody who's that much of a twat isn't yeah. wouldn't say it that way. They would give themselves other reasons. Mm. And plus, if you're that way with your own kid, then what a cunt you are. 
Oh. Yeah, what an you asshole. You got your own kid in there and you're taking out your fucking child. I didn't get what I wanted vengeance on him. I don't believe this guy. Yeah. Nah. Wow. Master bedroom, though. Oh, mm-hmm. just, it's and endless. decorations on a lousy door. Who cares? Uh, Nobody has the discussion. As soon as, you get, as soon as you open your apartment door, you're, there you go. You don't have to deal with the rest of the world. <laughs> right. <laughs> so who gives a fuck? You're in a, you're in a building, so you're pretty isolated to begin with. But that, that little voice where everybody would go, ah, that guy's an asshole. That person is now, oh, we're sorry. Like, everyone just is afraid right. of controversy or any conflict. Or, mm-hmm. Like, Pottery Barn is embarrassing to pull those. What happened? Th- I don't even know. Two costumes, not at all races. One is a sushi chef. Um, and it had, like, the Japanese flag on it or whatever. It's a costume representing that. And one's yeah. a uh, kimono order. And the, and the Asian group complained, and they pulled them. They're banning all kinds of uh, workplaces all over the place. <laughs> They're banning any type of ethnic um, costumes. So you, you can't. And then I heard, like, cowboys and Indians. Mm-hmm. Like, like the well, Indian one, you could say maybe. But why the cowboy? Your cowboy is not based on color or race no. or ethnicity. It's, it's an identity. It's not a race. They, I don't know what they want. They want a b- bunch of fucking because nobody nobody has the fucking discussion for real. Mm-hmm. They just go, "Why are we doing that?" And they go, "Well, we think it's best." Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Everyone's afraid of standing out in a negative way and being no, ostracized. I don't want to be the racist because we've all watched people oh. have their careers and their lives ruined mm-hmm. or being called racist or insensitive. I'm glad I just checked my Twitter. Kingston Pete, who's a good good guy on the on Twitter, he writes, "It's Black and Orange Day at my kid's school today." Uh, oh, is that what they call? Huh. They're not even calling it Halloween. Oh. You know what today is? That, it, that's, not, that's not happening. You know what today is at Sirius XM? What? what? It's the October Fall Gathering. No, no, it isn't. At oh, 1 o'clock. Yes. Where? 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 Here. Lobby. Stop In the it. lobby. <clears throat> let, me find the, let me find the actual wording Why for not you. Halloween? So it's happening right here in yeah, front of yeah, our yeah. eyes. Mm-hmm. Why? Why isn't it called Halloween? It's just... The they canceled the day out. because you're acknowledging it is Halloween. You're just changing the name and then it makes it okay? Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, uh, October oh, yeah. employee gathering. Come celebrate candy, the fall, and the company. Oh my God! <laughs> oh my it's God. happening right here in front of our eyes. You are invited, and that's not everybody. This is for me. You are invited to an employee gathering on uh, Thursday, October thirty first. <laughs> <laughs> uh, come have a quick bite and Halloween treats. Oh no! Oh, they, they said, said Halloween, Halloween treats. Halloween. Halloween treats. Uh huh. All right. It's not a Halloween party. They're just serving Halloween treats. Right. It's the October employee gathering. That's ridiculous. They'll have another employee gathering to celebrate the winter in December. Right, That's right. What they do. The winter gathering. Right. Oh, did you uh-huh. hear the last line? Um, Sam is fired. <laughs> <laughs> this is a great opportunity to get together with your coworkers and scare or surprise your coworkers with your costume. Oh, see, so they want you to dress up. We huh? should scare some people. Ooh. That's good. I saw a guy walking around uh, with a progeria kid costume uh, the other day. It's funny. That's very funny. <laughs> Did we used to work with him? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I, I was. All right. <laughs> oh, I know uh, you're talking about. <laughs> of course. Oh, no, Remember know. him? Yeah, he's the oldest progeria kid in the world. Yeah. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a regular kid. <laughs> you know how easy that would be for him to be a progeria kid for oh, yeah. for the uh, fall fall what? Okay. The fall, fall the October employee gathering to celebrate fall candy and the company. The gathering of the Dillados. <laughs> <laughs> hey, fucking, uh, what is that? Who? What meeting was was held? Well, for the wording of that, we're all guilty. Well, we can't man. put a Halloween party. You we're all guilty. We're allowing this shit. Oh man, it must have been a bunch of meetings. Yeah. I will accept no responsibility. I have been yelling and screaming about it and twittering about it, and that's all you can do is speak up. You uh-huh. can't make it happen. Mm-hmm. Right. I accept zero responsibility for this fucking dog yes. shit state we're in. So I guess we're supposed to all be the exact same person eventually, it's right? Is that where we're heading? But no, they, but they like they say they they stress diversity and individuality. That's all. But bullshit. they don't want it. Yeah, yeah it's bullshit. Mm. Complete bullshit. I don't just. I just don't know what the basis is. Like, like, is it a legal thing? No, it's a, it's, it, it a company. It is. No. Yeah, or yeah. maybe even a school. You know what? That might be it. Some parent 
Some fucking parent probably sued. Ugh. They didn't want to tell their kid, hey, we're uptight or we're Jehovah's Witnesses and we don't believe in right, God, whatever it was. Right, right, And no school wants to deal with the legality of it. It all comes down to lawsuits and legal Everything. bullshit. You're right. That's the whole, the whole push of where we're going yeah. is, is legalities right. Right. and nonsense by lawyers. Another guy, we don't have to go to him on the phone, but at his daughter's school, it's called the Harvest Party. Oh, a oh. Harvest Party. A haggis party. Yeah, it's always fun. <laughs> Leave your pants at the door. <laughs> <laughs> Creep. Why can't you just put out a, an email saying, hey, man, today Happy Halloween. I want to remind people today is Halloween. And I also want to remind you that kids will be showing up in costumes. So if you're one of these lame ass <laughs> fucking parents. Yeah. That don't want your kid in a costume. You might want to keep them home. Today. Stay home. Why? Because mm -hmm. it, it's one kid. It's two kids, maybe. Yeah. So the whole classroom has to suffer? The whole school has to suffer? And anybody who gets made fun of for having a shitty Halloween costume gets made fun of for having shitty clothes every other day of the year. <laughs> right. Yeah. Don't, you're not supposed to say the TH in clothes. Yeah. Clothes. Yeah. No, you don't say you clothes. You say clothes? <laughs> clothes? That's how the word is oh, spelled. No. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, a lot of things are spelled. How do you say clothes? Clothes. Just clothes. You don't say clothes. You say clothes. No, you don't. No. From cloth. No Maybe one says clothes. London. Clothes. clothes. Costume. Yeah. Clothes. Biak, biak. It's like you don't say uh, dowkey. You say douche. Yes. <laughs> Very good. Clothes. <laughs> Closes is what you do to a door. Do you say often? Yeah. Often. You're not supposed to. Yes, often. you are. It's a silent T. Often. It's not silent. It is silent. Often. It's not. Often. Silent. Absolutely. Often is not. Do you say often. psoriasis? That is a silent P. Oh, you say psycho. psychology? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the T Psychopath. is not silent and often. How do you say human? Human. How should I say it? You should say it like Kirk. Newman. Yeah, some people don't human. like to say human, 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 oh, no. human or something like that. Yeah, they there's, fuck it up a little bit. There's an H there that won't be ignored. Word. All right, well, that sucked. To hear the Opie and Anthony show five days a week, live on satellite radio, online on your phone or tablet, or even on demand, go to SiriusXM.com. Also, interact with the Opie and Anthony show on Twitter, at Opie Radio, at Anthony Cumia, and at Jim Norton.